So this is how you would make a silver mirror inside of a flask or something in your lab. Uh, just get a nice, nice little mirror on the inside. Um, and depending on what kind of glass you use, you can get some really cool designs. Uh, if you've done this on your own, you might have ended up with something that doesn't look as great. Something like this. You can see through a little bit over to this other side and it looks kind of splotchy. So I want to show you what I've been doing lately. It's been working really well. Here's something I made yesterday. I uh, just took an empty Sprite can. It looks awesome. Nice green metallic color. Uh, so I'm going to be doing this wine bottle here, which is courtesy of Charles Woodson, signed by him. And the setup for this kind of goes like this. So before I set up this video, I took a little bit of acetone and I poured it in the bottle. And what that's going to do is it's going to clean it off, but it's also going to dry very quickly. So highly volatile. Of course, you don't want to keep flame around it. Uh, but that's going to get this nice and nice and dry and nice and clean. Okay, and I'm going to add to it three things. The first thing I'm going to add is a mixture of silver nitrate and ammonium nitrate. Then I'm going to add some dextrose. And then last I'm going to put some sodium hydroxide in there. There's actually potassium hydroxide. but uh, And then I'm going to cover it and, and I'm going to kind of show you the technique we've been using to kind of get this to work really well. So here's our silver nitrate, ammonium nitrate, and here's my sugar, dextrose, and lastly we're going to put on the hydroxide. A little spill there. Before we get to that, put this around here best we can so it doesn't leak. We're going to start to coat this really nicely with silver metal. The trick that you want to do is you really want to give it a good shake every once in a while. And that agitation kind of gets you a really, really nice clean glass look. Just for whatever reason it kind of gets more chemical contact or I don't know, but you can already see that looks, that looks really nice right there. And of course, when you're done, you want to you want to pour this down the drain um, with a lot of water. You don't want this to dry out; it can, it can form explosives. Uh, so you want to get that mix out. Looks like we got a really, really good clean silver look. I'm gonna get this rinsed and then I'll show. It. So here we have the final product. Um, this this one was really not done very well, but this one's a little nicer. But here, when we get into the part where we kind of shake it a little bit. This is where you really get a nice even coating of silver mirror on the inside. And it just looks great. And here is our Charles Woodson autograph. You can see in the reflection there. Okay, and it just looks really, really nice all the way around. So. That's it.